Hi, I'm Aina and I'm Caroline and we are Icona Pop and you're listening to 1031 Virgin Radio. It's Toby from 1031 Virgin Radio here with I know and Caroline, you may know them as Icona Pop. Yay! Yay! Yes. Playing Investors Group Field tonight with One Direction. Yeah. How did you guys get on with One Direction? Well, we have a lot of mutual friends. Oh. And so it started off that we heard that they were going on a tour. And then basically we talked with our people and they talked with their people and uh, they were like, yeah, sure. And you guys are playing uh, big outdoor venues, like, yeah. like uh, Vancouver, and you played uh, the Commonwealth Stadium in Edmonton yep. the other night. Crazy. And now you're playing the best group field. What is, do you guys like playing those big outdoor shows? Yeah, uh, we love that. It's, it's crazy. It's so much people. It's such good vibe. People have been waiting for a long time. They're like excited and they're ready to, to dance. So. so when you guys met, you guys met at a party mm -hmm. and um, you had just got through a, a nasty breakup. Mm -hmm. I did a little research. Oh, that's okay. good. I love that. <laughs> and then over at your place, because I guess you used to have parties all the time. Oh like really, dear. Really fun parties. Crazy. The best in town. So I've heard. <laughs> yep. <laughs> what are the main ingredients for the best in town kind of parties? I think, um, no, it starts with great people. With Because I don't think it's about where you are or getting into the hottest Parties. It's about having a great group of friends getting together, playing great music, and then you can have a party yeah. wherever. Then you can have a party wherever. I was thinking like balloons or like a clown or a petting zoo. Oh, or something. No, 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 no. That you can add whenever you want to. Oh, but yeah. I think the main ingredients is just like chemistry. Obviously, when you guys started out, you're writing your music and you're getting to know each other as well, which should be a fun process. Oh, but yeah. Do you ever just take a moment on stage when you're playing a big show like Investor Group Field at the Coliseum or Commonwealth Stadium and just think, this is the dream we had when we started out? Do you ever just take a moment and just say oh, to yourself, yeah? Yeah, all yeah. the time. I think. Like, we usually just sit down and we just burst into a huge laugh because we're like, wow. I mean, we dreamed always big, but when you're like, wow, we were sitting in the sofa in Stockholm eight years ago, and now we're like on a stadium tour with one of the biggest bands. And you're like, what happened? When you're not on stage, what's the best part of your day? Ooh, I think the coolest thing for us is to meet the fans, of course, that we've been talking with online on like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and to finally meet them yeah. and to talk to them and get to know them better. And you guys were down at the Forks yesterday? Yeah. yeah. What did you think? Beautiful. Was, yeah. We, we, we saw the, the stupid thing was we just had food before we get, got there. Yeah. Right. We so like, this looks so much, food. this looks so nice. We should have just had food there. Mm -hmm. Walking around, people are so nice here. Yeah. yeah. Say like the last text message you received mm -hmm. had to be on your tombstone. The very last text message is what you received had to be on your tombstone. What would your tombstone say? I know it's, it sounds morbid, um, but it's more fun than it plays on. I love you. See, that's good. See, Mama. Mama yeah. <laughs> that's a nice one. Uh, I'm trying to think. I think mine was. Where are you? <laughs> trying to reach you. <laughs> but that's a pretty good time, Mama. Oh, my, uh, my girlfriend's really clumsy and she's actually texted this to me, so I thought I would immortalize her. the shower. <laughs> she's actually texted me that on, on several times. So let's say, let's change it up. If you did okay. a t-shirt of something that would perfectly encapsulate your relationship together, okay, what would um, your shirt say? Uh, oh, I think if it would be just like a quote, more? Mm -hmm. I know would have been so. I have a question. <laughs> oh, okay. She says that a lot. Okay. And I love when she says that. So that would definitely be the quote. Oh dear, that's a good one. Okay. So you it will be uh, the world's worst liar. <laughs> she can't lie. No, I can't. I'm very she bad at lying. Super stressed. Really? Yeah, I can't lie. That's good though, right? Yeah. Not always. Not I do the lying. But I'm very good at talking around Talk, stuff. Yeah, she's amazing when it comes. So I, I talk around stuff as much as I can, and then if someone like, but Caroline, then I can't lie. Then I'm no. like, sorry. And you turn red. Yeah. What's uh, One last question. What's next for you guys after tour? After this particular tour? Are well, you guys going to get back to the studio? Um, uh, yeah. We're not going to have a vacation, that's for sure. 
We're gonna be in the studio uh, finishing up our album. We just released an EP, but we're gonna finish the album as well. Um, and then we have so much to do, but we can't really tell you. Well, we look forward to seeing you guys tonight in Best Crew Field with One Direction. Thank you well, so thank much. Thank you. Thank you. I love it.